Hi there, this is Teacher Love Podcast, episode 205, Speaking Activator 3, Camping. I'm Ola, an English teacher with over a decade of teaching under my belt. I firmly believe that unlocking fluency is within your reach. In fact, the key to fluency is in your pocket. Imagine confidently speaking English, conquering your fears and embracing effective communication. To support you on your journey, I invite you to explore my website where you'll find transcripts, helpful worksheets, English live classes, worksheet sets, transcripts, everything. So just head to teacherola.com. I'm here to guide you every step of the way. Let's make speaking English enjoyable and fulfilling. Enjoy your journey to fluency. Happy learning! Hello there! Thank you so much for inviting me to your day. We are going to activate your speaking today. The main topic is camping. In a moment, I'll give you a list of vocabulary items you need and later I'll tell you a short story that includes all the vocabulary items from the list. Next, I'll give you three questions. Write them down and after the episode uh, finishes, talk to yourself. Answer the questions out loud. Try to use as many camping words as possible. But first, I need your help. I want to create a brand new online course that will teach you how to become a confident speaker of English. I would like you to go to teacherla.com forward slash newsletter, join my newsletter and complete a survey that will immensely help me create a perfect course. Please go to teacherola.com forward slash newsletter and become a member of top people every week. I'll send you one email with a speaking task that will push you to speak English. And please join us, get access to these Wednesday speaking lessons and complete the survey. Thank you. Once again, it's teacherola.com forward slash newsletter. Let's get back to the episode. 29 vocabulary items connected with camping. After the list, you'll hear a short story that includes all the vocabulary items. Next, and I know I'm repeating myself, but I want to make sure everything is clear. So after the list, listen and note down the three questions. And when the episode ends, answer the questions, say your sentences, say your answers out loud. I hope you remember. Don't forget to stay with me till the practical part where you repeat the sentences out loud. Here we go. The list of 29 expressions connected with camping. Listen and repeat out loud. Tent. Tent. Sleeping bag. Sleeping bag. Campfire, campfire, backpack, backpack, campsite, campsite, campground, campground, hiking, hiking. Cooking stove, cooking stove, lantern, lantern, sleeping pad, sleeping pad, hammock, hammock, camp chair, camp chair, picnic table. Picnic table. To grill. To grill. Outdoor cooking. Outdoor cooking. Camping gear. Camping gear. Campfire songs. Campfire songs. S'mores. S'mores. Insect repellent. Insect repellent. Campsite rules. Campsite rules. Campsite fees. Campsite fees. Wilderness. 
wilderness, nature, nature, wildlife, wildlife, campsite amenities, campsite amenities, campfire safety, campfire safety, outdoor adventure, outdoor adventure, campsite setup, campsite setup, outdoor cooking, outdoor cooking. Okay, here you have the list of camping words. Now the story. In this story, you'll hear all 29 or maybe 28 words. You can even try to count them all. Let's begin. It was a sunny weekend when our group of adventurous friends decided to escape the city and head into the wilderness for an unforgettable camping trip. Packed with excitement, we grabbed our backpacks filled with camping gear and hit the road. After a few hours of driving, we arrived at the campsite. It was a beautiful spot nestled deep in the heart of nature, surrounded by tall trees and the sounds of wildlife. The campsite fees were inclusive, covering access to showers, electricity and recreational facilities. The campsite setup was well organized and efficient with clearly marked sites, ample space and easy access to amenities. We quickly set up our tent, unrolled our cozy sleeping bags and inflated our sleeping pads. Ready for adventure, we laced up our hiking boots and hit the nearby trails, leaving campgrounds behind. As we explored the wilderness, we marveled at the breathtaking scenery, taking in the sights and sounds of nature. After a long hike, we returned to the campsite, famished and ready for a delicious campfire cooked meal. With the cooking stove fired up, we grilled our favorite foods and shared stories around the campfire. The crackling campfire provided warmth as we sat on our comfy camp chairs around the picnic table, indulging in gooey s'mores and singing campfire songs. The lanterns illuminated our laughter-filled faces as we recounted our outdoor adventures and shared spooky tales of the wilderness. As night fell, we were enveloped by the peaceful ambience of the campsite. We relaxed in our hammocks, gazing up at the starry sky. The distant howls added a touch of wildness to the atmosphere. Insect repellent kept pesky bugs away as we enjoyed the tranquility of the great outdoors. Throughout our camping adventure, we followed the campsite rules, ensuring campfire safety and respecting nature. We embraced every outdoor adventure opportunity that came our way, from hiking to wildlife spotting. As the sun rose on our final day, we reluctantly packed up our camping gear and bid farewell to the campsite. Our hearts were full of cherished memories and we vowed to return to the wilderness soon for more thrilling outdoor adventures and unforgettable camping experiences. That's the story. I know it's quite silly, like who takes a camping chair into the wilderness? But that's even better, in fact. The crazier the stories, the funniest, the easier to memorize them. Now, hear the three questions and jot them down to answer later on when the episode ends. Okay, listen. One, what camping gear would you consider essential for a successful camping trip? explain why. 2. Describe your ideal campsite setup and company. 3. Share a memorable camping experience and the outdoor activities you enjoyed during the trip. If you don't have any, make it up. Let's practice. This is the most important part of the episode. You know what to do. Listen and repeat out loud. The campsite fees were inclusive. The campsite fees were inclusive. 
It was a beautiful spot nestled deep in the heart of nature. It was a beautiful spot nestled deep in the heart of nature. We relaxed in our hammocks, gazing up at the starry sky. We relaxed in our hammocks, gazing up at the starry sky. We grabbed our backpacks filled with camping gear and hit the road. We grabbed our backpacks filled with camping gear and hit the road. Adventurous friends decided to escape the city and head into the wilderness for an unforgettable camping trip. Adventurous friends decided to escape the city and head into the wilderness for an unforgettable camping trip. We quickly set up our tent, unrolled our cozy sleeping bags and inflated our sleeping pads. We quickly set up our tent, unrolled our cozy sleeping bags and inflated our sleeping pads. After a long hike, we returned to the campsite famished and ready for a delicious campfire cooked meal. After a long hike, we returned to the campsite famished and ready for a delicious campfire cooked meal. We followed the campsite rules, ensuring campfire safety and respecting nature. We followed the campsite rules, ensuring campfire safety and respecting nature. Our hearts were full of cherished memories and we vowed to return to the wilderness soon. Our hearts were full of cherished memories and we vowed to return to the wilderness soon. Here you have it, 10 sentences with 29 camping words. Now download the worksheet and practice some more, it's in your inbox. If you're not a member of Top People, download the worksheet from teacherola.com forward slash 205. Also join my newsletter every Wednesday, I'll send an email that'll remind you to practice speaking. It will give you a practical speaking exercise and of course the new podcast episode with the worksheet. It's at teacherola.com forward slash newsletter double t thanks for listening i'll see you next wednesday happy learning take care stay fearless and say it out loud 
Bye. Masz blokadę językową. Dużo rozumiesz, ale nie mówisz płynnie. Brakuje Ci słów, czasem tych najprostszych. Nie potrafisz szybko reagować. Jak masz coś powiedzieć po angielsku, zżera Cię stres. Masz blokadę językową, bo rządzi Tobą strach. Na szczęście można nauczyć się mówić swobodnie. Serio, można nauczyć się mówić swobodnie. Weź udział w darmowym wyzwaniu Powiedz Coś. Wejdź na stronę powiedzcoś.pl. Zapisz się na darmowe wyzwanie. Your journey to fluency starts now. Powiedzcoś.pl